Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Honorable Greg B. And today we're doing another stack of packs from this 1998 uh, Topps Major League Baseball Series 2 Hobby Box. Um, if you didn't, if you missed last time, go check that out up there. Then head on down, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell as well. Hit that thumbs up if you don't like the video. Hit that share button, share this with everyone in the world. Head on in the comments and say hello and let's talk about some baseball related stuff or whatever. You know, with spring training well on its way and we headed to opening day pretty soon um let's talk about some baseball or let's talk about 98 too i mean tell me who you're rooting for back then and who you, sosa or or mcguire who are you rooting for to break the record first or who you were who are you rooting for to have the overall total i don't know tell me if you remember if you were alive then <laughs> you know uh but um also check out the links in the in the description for blog podcast and other social media all right let's do these Nine packs. Uh, yeah. From the stack. Uh, we did okay last time. Uh, not great. Not terrible. We got our mystery finest, but which they, it wasn't even like a mystery. I don't even, I don't know. We got our bordered mystery finest. So just the generic basic version. And it was Larry Walker. Not, you know, a little bit of spoiler, but like it wasn't a mystery of who you're getting. It was a mystery of like whether or not it had a border or a refractor. But like you knew what card it was, so I don't know. I don't really like that as much. I kind of, I'm kind of glad they got rid of the whole thing, anyways. But we did get a minted in Cooperstown. We got one of those. We got the, we got a Clemente reprint. We got a rookie class. So we're still expecting more of those. We're also still expecting our focal points, and hopefully, maybe some one of those. What are they called? Clout cards. It's not guaranteed. But we can, we can hope. Um. All right, we got a Mark Kotze. These are sticking together a little bit. Not terrible. It gets worse as you get bottom, down to the bottom of the box for whatever reason. I still don't understand the science on that. Um, but, you know, it's just, it is what it is given, you know, the time period of these cards. So there you go. Uh, John Franco, Andy Benes. We got something cool coming up. Will Clark, uh, Ugeth Urbina. It is a Roberto Clemente... It's not a refractor, but it's what are these called? They're the just the finest. The yeah, Clemente finest. So we weren't guaranteed one of these. That's cool. Um, it's just uh, the regular version. It's not a refractor version, but still very cool. Very cool. We've got Ron Gant. Uh, we got draft picks of Michael Mc. Uh, no, sorry. What is that? Is it Darnell McDonald and <laughs> Michael McDonald? <laughs> what was I thinking? uh natemi i don't even i'm not even gonna attempt to say that name that guy craig biggio hall of famer of course uh we got more draft picks of ryan anderson and mark mag magnum mangum mangum excuse me lance johnson rounding things out for that pack so yeah that clemente uh finest that's cool that's cool uh we got carlos delgado uh, next up, we got uh, Carl Pavano, Pavano, Craig Council. Then we got uh, Dave DeLucci, Jeremy Gonzalez, uh, Jeff Conine, Donovan Osborne, Rod Beck, Scott Stalviak, I don't know. D Devon White and Jimmy Kin K Jimmy Key round things out there. Next pack, we got um, Tom Goodwin sliding th sliding into third. We got interleague preview with um, Tino Martinez and that Gary Sheffield. Gary Sheffield it's got Dur Darren Erstadt. Uh, 97 season highlights, Kurt Schilling sets righty whiff record. Um, I already kind of went into my whole spiel about Kurt Schilling not making the Hall of Fame in the last video. Go check that out. I don't want to get into it again. But speaking of Hall of Famers, we do have a Roberto Alomar, Hall of Famer. Uh, Mark McGuire, season highlights from 97. Obviously, 98, he had a pretty good year too. So there's Mark McGuire. Uh, Andres Galarraga with Andy Ashby. Bip Roberts, Brian Johnson, and Rich Butler rounding things out in that pack. Next up, 
see what we get in this next pack. We got a Jason Schmidt. Back when he was on the Pirates. <clears throat> Corey Lytle, that's uh, his rookie card, I believe. Ryan McGuire. Uh, Quinton McCracken. Troy Percival. Uh, Joe Randa. Mike Lansing. Ramon Martinez. Jeff Supon. Ray Durham. And uh, Cecil Fielder. When he was on the Angels. Wow, I don't remember him on the Angels at all. Of course, Corey Lytle, uh, unfortunately, passed away in a plane crash, if I remember correctly. Um, yeah, he was, he was a... So he had a plane and was flying around and lost... I don't know what happened. And, yeah, unfortunately, he crashed the plane and passed away. Um, sad story. Al Martin. Um, not Not too much different... I mean, I get that's you know. Now that I think about it, that's that's kind of like a. That's not. He's not the only one that that's happened to. I mean, obviously Roy Holiday had a crashed plane too. Um, Steve Finley, Reggie Jefferson, Jeff King, uh, Sterling Hitchcock, Jose Cruz Jr. Checklist card. There's Mark McGuire, Big Mac, uh, Brian Anderson, and Roger Clemens. Back when he was on the Blue Jays. Uh, for the couple of years and dominated, of course, steroids, <laughs> probably, uh, most likely, definitely, uh, helped him out those years, I would imagine. Uh, Otis Nixon, got Bernie Williams, Enrique Wilson, John Wetland, uh, Kevin Tappany, we got another one of these rookie class cards of Fernando Tatis, now see, that was Fernando Tatis Jr., be a great card, but it'd be way before he was he was even born. I don't think he was even born yet. But this is Dad Fernando Testis. Just weird to see a rookie related card with Fernando Testis Senior. Um, we got draft picks of what do we got? Uh, JJ Davis and Troy Gloss. There we go. There's Troy Gloss's rookie card. Jason Kendall. We got uh, Jason Worth and um, Dan Rickert. I guess that's Jason Wirth's rookie card, too. Wouldn't it have been? I don't know. Barry Larkin, Hall of Famer. And he's sticking to some more draft picks of John Curtis and Mike Kadire. Mike Kadire? Oh, solid player. I mean, I don't know. These It always gets confusing with the rookie cards back in these days because, like, it was kind of arbitrary when they got their rookie cards. It's like, oh, his draft pick. Oh, he gets his rookie card. Oh, you know, he finally came up. Oh, he gets a... There was no rhyme or reason to it. So in like 2006, I believe it was, they kind of like MLB was like, hey, listen, if you guys are going to give these guys rookie cards, they have to actually have been in the league or going to be on the roster or something like that. You can't just give these prospects willy-nilly rookie cards because it gets confusing. Um, but then, of course, they had, then they introduced the prospect cards, which just... Throws a whole other thing into it. But at least for the rookies, it's a little easier to know what the rookie cards are versus the prospect cards. But we got Greg Maddox, Hall of Famer. Throw him on down here. Uh, Yvonne Hernandez, John Olerud. Got uh, Richard Heldago. We got Nomar, uh, Gold Cup cards. So that's pretty cool. I'll throw him on down there. We got the uh, Minted in Cooperstown card. I'm running out of space here. Uh, then we got uh, Ken Hull, Chris Holt, Shannon Stewart, John, and John Burkett. Round things out. All right, a couple more packs for today, and come back next week. We'll do another stack. Come back every day. I got videos posted every day, so you can check those out. We got uh, Brad Rigby. We got Roberto Hernandez. Jermaine Allensworth, Moises Alou, Ed Sprague, Pete Shirok, Shir 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 yeah, Bobby Higginson, sticking with Jay Bell, then Jeff Fasaro, Walt Weiss, and Dennis uh, Reyes. I'm rounding things out there. All right, last pack for today. So you get out of here. Come back next week as we get closer and closer to opening day. Um, we got Dean Palmer. We got season highlights of John Olru. Hits for the cycle. 
Todd Hunley, Roger Clemens wins pitching's triple crown. So another Roger Clemens card. We got Brian Jordan hitting a uh, football because you know, obviously he played football as well. It's kind of interesting card. We got Brad Racky wins 12 in a row. Uh, Juan Guzman. We got Pedro Martinez, obviously a Hall of Famer when he joined the Red Sox. Dave Nilsson. Brent Birdie and Mark Clark. Mark Clark. All right. Thank you, everyone, for watching. We did pretty well that time. We got the Roberto Clemente cards. Pretty cool. But McGuire, Clemens, Pedro, Maddox. Um, Gold-minted card. Barry Larkin, Troy Gloss, uh, Corey Lytle, Nomar, Gold Cup. All right. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Stay safe. Have fun. We'll see you next time.